Hey, everyone. So I have something I want to uh, talk about. And this is um, from one of the workshops that uh, I lead consistently. And it's my favorite quote. And it goes like this. It's by Howard Thurman. Howard Thurman was Mar uh, Martin Luther King Jr.'s coach and mentor. And he says, don't look for what the world needs. Look for what makes you come alive and then go do that. Because what the world needs is more people who have come alive. Are you feeling alive where you are in your life? Whether it's your work, it's whether you work for somebody, it's a job or a business. Are you feeling alive? Are you inspired by what you're doing? Think about it. Or is it drudgery every single day where you get up in the morning and you dread the day because you really don't want to be doing what you're doing? Or in the area of your health, are you feeling alive? Do you have vibrant health? So he says, don't look for what the world needs. Look for what makes you come alive and go do that. Because what the world needs is more people who have come alive. You know, sometimes it's our health that holds us back. Sometimes there are relationships that really take our energy. They are a drain. But we are always you want to keep looking for what is it that makes me come alive okay granted you know sometimes there's only so much you and i can do when it comes to interacting with other people right people in our life you know they impact us often you know whether it's family or whether it's business associates or whether it's just you know somebody in the world but we have a say in what we are going to do, and how we are going to maintain our aliveness. So my invitation to you is, if you are not feeling alive, schedule a call with me, because I would love to have a brief conversation with you and give you certain tips that will have you think in new ways that you maybe have never thought of before. My link is the link for my calendar is meetsandhya.com. Again, remember what Howard Thurman says. Don't look for what the world needs. Look for what makes you come alive and then go do that. Because what the world needs is more people who have come alive. What inspires you? Yes, you have a job. But that doesn't mean you can't do what you love and what inspires you. You can always find a way to do it. Begin to ask yourself the question, how can I do what inspires me? Or what action, what is a little step that I can take that's going to move me in the direction of what inspires me? Because what inspires you? will leave you empowered, will leave you joyful, will leave you happy. And guess what happens when you're happy and you're jo joyful and you're inspired? That spills over and has an impact on everybody around you. So go look for what inspires you. Ask those questions and really take me up on my offer. Get on my calendar, meetsandhya.com. And I'll be happy to have a conversation with you and share with you how you can live and create, a, create and live a life that you love. Again, it's meetsandhya.com. And may you live an inspired life. More later. Bye-bye.